um, Juma Miro, I'm a boxer, um, also a, a Commonwealth a bronze medalist. Yeah. Uh, what inspired me to join boxing was uh, my grandfather, Hussein Khalil, and my dad. So they inspired me to join boxing and uh, they trained me since childhood until uh, I became a Commonwealth champion. Yeah. Uh, ever since I started my boxing at East Coast Boxing Gym, I've represented them in the, so many tournaments, the juniors tournament, uh, novice, champ, uh, intermediate, and I've been doing well, getting gold medal, and also bringing trophies back to the gym. The Commonwealth Games, uh, we started uh, training in the camp with the national team, and we had a trial in Tanzania. Then I had to qualify among the five boxers because we started uh, 75 boxers. Then they only needed five boxers, but uh, luckily I was uh, among the five boxers who qualified to go for to uh, win a medal, rank number one in Africa yeah, after the Commonwealth Games because I, I, I fought uh, African best, the African number one, yeah, and I had to beat him. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, it was a light fly. Uh, Fazil Juma is my brother and we used to have a, a competition among us like to see who is the best. Uh, I remember in 2013 I was going for the uh, African Championship. Uh, then I, uh, I broke my jaw. Some, some people attacked me and they hit me with a baseball bat. Uh, the reason why I turned pro is uh, I have a target by next year. This year, this year I was supposed to be turning professional and for a day going to the, um, one of the um, biggest tournaments in the world and I was ready to turn professional already but I, uh, with Mohanjo's contract it will, take, it will take me four years to leave amateur so I didn't accept that. That's why I, I decided to branch and go for professional. Okay, when of course, right now I have a contract with KCCA, and I cannot turn, I cannot sign another, another contract with uh, with Mohanj. Yeah, uh, I want to be remembered as a champion, as a legend. I'm still working hard to see that I, I be a world champion. I want to also uh, have the WBC, the WBO, IBF belt. So I'm working hard to see that I get that. That's why I, I turned professional, to start uh, uh, working hard and fighting to see that I get to uh, the World uh, Boxing Council, the WBC. Yeah. Whom would you say is the best boxer to have trained at the East Coast Gym uh, to now? Yeah, I think my brother, Fazil Jo. Fazil, the toughest opponent you've ever met in the boxing ring? Uh, the toughest bo uh, opponent I've ever met in the box is the Asian number one, Amit Pangal, uh, Indian. Yeah. Uh, uh, my advice to the young talents is uh, let them stay focused, uh, act well to other people. Uh, they don't take boxing for uh, to go and rob people in the streets. Let them keep discipline everywhere. They will reach where, where they want to be and they will be a world champion one day also.